in the last video I've reviewed how to make a wireframe in Dreamweaver um, and I used the the size and the settings as set forth in this template right here or this wireframe plan um, however I did forget something I, as, as you may recall I saw the bottom right here I was missing something there's a little bit of a gap at the bottom and the thing I was missing was the whole navigation bar now I can add that re relatively easy in Dreamweaver using the same process and moving a few things around so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add this banner or excuse me this nav bar it's in purple right here and it's gonna be 25 by 800 pixels so I'm gonna add that purple box right underneath the banner and so I'm gonna show you how to do that right here in, in Dreamweaver and it's not too difficult you can um, mouse over have your um, mouse in any section and kinda highlight any area I'm gonna kinda highlight where my wrapper um, is for my um, actual banner so this is my banner um, it's called wrapper called banner that text is a little wrong um, sorry about that but this was actually the banner the content ID for banner um, doesn't really matter what text that is and we're gonna replace all that and I'll show you how to do that in the next video but um, I'm gonna add that nav bar by using the same process I used before I'm just gonna highlight this area this banner and choose insert go down to layout object and choose div tag same as I did in last video and right here I have a choice to insert this wrap around the selection before the tag after start a tag before the end of the tag and after the tag now because I have this top banner selected I actually want the nav bar to come under it or right after this tag um, you, if you wanted it before you could choose before if you want after you could choose after but in our case we want to choose after now let's say we do this wrong I'm gonna well I'll choose after I'll do it right the first time but I'll show you how to move around in the code as well in just a second now the nav bar is gonna be called nav bar it's an ID tag just like everything else that we have created so far and it is gonna be a new CSS rule so I'm gonna click on that button it, it already sets up this is an ID tag for me and I just have to hit OK to choose the settings and just like before I'm going to choose the settings this is 25 by 800 pixels so I'm going to choose box choose width at 800 the height is 25 and the float is left because it's going to push it to the left and the margin is auto and I'm going to go ahead and hit OK and hit OK and that should have put the nav bar in the right spot but as you see it didn't it actually kicked it down below now if I look at at where it is it's actually not within the wrapper it's actually way down here so it may have been something I chose wrong sometimes Dreamweaver just doesn't cooperate like you want it to but you can fix that pretty easily actually just by moving it around in the code um, that's probably the easiest way to move it and you see if I highlight the code it kinda highlights this square this wireframe um, or this rectangle um, like you see in, in a bluish color and so all I want to do is move that up and these are in order this this should be banner and then nav bar and then main and then images and then footer like you see so I'm just gonna move it up by clicking and dragging it you could copy or choose edit copy and then choose edit paste or you may be able to just drag it like I am right here and that should be all you need just hit a hard enter or just hit the enter key and after main and that should that should fix it um, and so like you see here now it looks like it's correct and as you see here you should be able to see um, wrapper and then banner then nav bar then main then images then footer so I'm sorry I missed that in the last one um, but again if you want to preview it you can click on this little globe icon and choose preview in Firefox Safari Opera Chrome whatever um, browser you want to again you'll have to save it so just hit save again open like this of course there's not really any content just that basic text so you'll be able to kind of get an idea of where everything is um, and it's not really going to be anything spectacular to look at but it will give you an idea of where everything is and that everything is in place 